getting ready to talk to my friend on Skype and I made my delicious tea latte. So I made it with the soy milk that's vanilla because they've been added the one that's unsweetened for weeks now so I haven't been able to find it. And it tastes really good. When I whipped up the soy milk that's vanilla flavored, it tastes like whipped cream. It was like really good. So we are just gonna relax today. I'm gonna study. We're gonna try to take Molly for a walk, but Jason's knee's been bothering him, so I'm having him wear his knee brace. And he sits in games for a long time. And I think having his knees bent is probably that. So I brought the stool in there for him to kind of like prop his leg up and keep it straight. So I think that'll help. And Yesterday we went on, a, no not yesterday, yesterday I had my client, so yesterday I was, a, I was working with my client all day. Um, Sunday we went to the trail that's just right up the road and it's, it's beautiful. I absolutely loved it. I'm going to have to go back there and explore and like maybe read a book or something next to the stream that I tried to film. I didn't film as much on my GoPro because I'm also filming for my Instagram. So you'll see I have a lot of reels on Instagram, so go check those out too. I have the... I need to put the link down below. I don't think I have the link. I think I just have like my name, but I need to go put the link. That way people just click on it and they can go straight to it. It's just harder to find it, the link from Instagram because I can't link it from my phone. I only can do it from the computer. And so that's, what's, that's what we've been doing. And Jason's off all this week. So we're gonna try to hike each day. Um, not necessarily like long hikes, especially since his knee's kind of like messing up or hurting and bothering him. So we're going to just maybe go on little, little walks with malls like around our apartment and just see what's around here. Because there's a tons of trails and parks within 10 minutes of us. It's so cool living out here in Washington and having the access. I feel like here almost on every single street corner there's something, some kind of green space, trail, park, stream, waterfall. Just It's just absolutely magical living here. I love it so much. Oh, and I like looking at houses each day because I love real estate. I can't wait till I'm working in it and getting paid to go do this, but I almost want to go check out an open housing for this um, like multi-family lot that's in Everett, downtown Everett, which I would love. It's next to the ocean. You can see the beautiful water and sunsets, but oh my gosh, it's three separate houses, like houses, and everyone has their own little space, like green space, like yards and everything, and it's like right under a million dollars. Like that's just crazy crazy to have that many houses for sale. I mean, I guess if you think of places, you know, like cost of living in very rural and more impoverished places, they have a cheaper cost of living, but here it's very expensive. Land and housing is very expensive. So that price is just like really, really amazing. So I'm thinking about going and checking that out maybe Friday. I think it closes on Monday. So as long as I go see it before Monday, because I know it's going to sell for sure. Like, definitely, hands down. Because it's too good of a place. Like, if we could buy it and have rent out the other two places for quite a bit, then it would, um, we could definitely qualify for the note, I feel like. But we'd have to find a lender that would take into account the rental amount, you know, like to help us qualify because there's no way that we can qualify for almost a million dollar loan because we don't make that much money. But if we can have that help us qualify for it, then that would be amazing. I just don't know if it's really run down. That's why I want to go check it out and see it for myself. Mm -hmm. 